met in high school. I just knew he was my soulmate from, for the rest of my life. He provided a very good living for us. We didn't need or want for anything. He always instilled good work ethics and to be kind to people because that's the way he was. And he wanted to instill that in the children. Me being the oldest son, my father was strict but loving. He always wanted to make sure we had everything we needed. I was the only daughter, which was wonderful. My dad did everything with me. He was a loving dad. He couldn't wait for us to have kids. That's what he wanted to be. That's what he wanted to do. With his grandkids, it was nothing but love. It's very sad that they don't get that because we knew the dad that we had growing up and I really wanted them to have that grandparent. And so when he passed away, it was just like, Half of me was taken. It had been raining and he was working for a neighbor and he was going to go get some stuff to check on the job site. He said, I'll be back by lunch. And he never came home. And I began to worry, tried calling, no answer. And then it kept getting later and later when the highway patrol came and I opened my sliding glass door. I thought it was him. And I opened it, and when I saw the highway patrol car, I fell to my knees, because I knew what that meant. They came to tell me he had passed in the accident. And I just didn't really know how to accept it. I went from being a 40-year-old adult father to feeling like I was 10 years old, not knowing what I was going to do, what my next step was. We were really glad that our brother called Ryan and his team, Wazell and Associates, and they were out there the next day. The next day they were out there looking, going over everything. I mean, it was amazing. And they were there for us. And they've been there for us the whole time. It was, we're here. This doesn't look right, we know it doesn't look right, and we're gonna to get to the bottom of it, and we're gonna get the answers that you want and that you need, because you deserve them. Well, I knew they were doing a lot of work because they would let us know. And then when we got to trial, it was like, oh my gosh. One of the reenactment guys that the specialist that Ryan with Zell Associates used found a bolt, narrowed a bolt down to where it made contact with our father's vehicle. That right there, that kind of precision, I don't know if anybody else that would go that deep to find someone to get the job done for you. Finally was like just a weight off of our shoulders that we finally understood the real answer for what happened that day. The answer that we knew happened that day, but we were told for years it wasn't. And we had a police report that said, you're wrong and your dad was wrong. And that was never the case. On the day of, there was supposed to have been the closing arguments, Ryan came to us and said, the other side is want to reach an agreement, make a settlement. Ryan with Zell and Associates fought for us. It doesn't take away all the pain, but it is something saying, hey, my father was worth something. Before he passed, he had had plans made to build a house. So I'm going to build his dream home that he had so there's plenty of room for everybody. It was 100%. Zell and Associates, they did absolutely everything for us. If I ever need lawyers again, I would like them to all be as great as Zell and associates.